What's up everybody, I'm that Kev guy, and welcome back to Resident Evil Village. Last time we left off, we started doing this puzzle, which is like a wedding box that plays like a magical tune, and has these two figures on it, and we have to figure out how to play it, but it's like, how am I supposed to figure this out? <laughs> they all look the same! Oh wait, wait a second, no, there is a way to figure this out. <gasps> wait a second, oh my god. I got this. I got this. No, that's... Yes. 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 I think I got it. Oh my god, if I got this. Ooh. Oh my god, that's awesome! Wow, you just have to like look at like wow the little details. That's that's awesome. Like the fact that like a game can kind of like ah uh, the amount of detail they could put in that like you know you just have to match like the the dents and the cracks and the scratches to it. Like that's pretty cool. Oh my god, I've managed to figure that out fairly quickly. I'm I'm very proud of myself. Tap 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 myself on the back. Yeah. Alright, I got some tweezers like that I can take this thing out of its mouth. Whoa. What is this? Whoa. And she's hanging. That's interesting. I don't know. Oh god. Alright, let's examine the mouth and use tweezers to take this out. Whoa. Hey. I'm not doing anything wrong. What? 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 Can't tell me about what. I don't like that. Oh! Lee crap, man. I'm ready. Oh, God. If you're telling me this game hasn't got any more scary, then I'm not sure how much more I can survive. My God. I can use this way. What is this? I examine. It's locked. Nothing. Oh, wow. Okay, looks like I'm trapped here. Examine this. Put this film. Uh, interesting. Village in the shadows. Oh wait, I got it, I got it. Maybe? Looks like it's not in the right order. So what's the order it should be in? Looks like it's not in the right order. Ah! Maybe this will give me a clue. A happier family. Rose's best friend in the whole wide world. She really likes this fairy tale. The most important thing in the world to us. A wedding gift from grandma. Proof of Ethan proof of Ethan's everlasting love for me. So uh so it's her best friend. What is the next one? She really likes this fairy tale. You really, you really think that your daughter likes Village of the Shadows as a fairy tale? The most important thing to us in the world, which I'm assuming the third is Rose. And then yeah, so this is it. Ah, 
this is it. What is this? God, I'm not like I don't have a gun. Like this is the no, another thing that kind of pisses me off right now is that I don't have a gun to defend myself. And the dolls are back, of course. Oh, and they're just all looking at me. I don't like dolls. Oh, thank you, fat scissors. Let me just. Use these scissors. Okay. I don't like the way they just like have been floating. Pick up the phone, Ethan. Okay. I just picked up the phone. Hello? Oh god, the music's ain't intense. Please, Ethan, listen to me. I didn't want to keep it from you. Mia? I didn't want to lose you again. I didn't want to destroy this family. Mia, what are you talking about? I love you both so much. I had to. I had to do it. Do what, lady? I love how you didn't even care enough to ask her more questions. No more ringing the- no more. No more. I just need to make my way back. All right. Open the door. Oh my god. Their arms are dropping on the floor. Use these scissors. What's inside? I'm looking around. Ah, uh, the crest. Ah, uh, the last one I need. What's wrong with those? What is wrong with those? Like, finish your sentence. No. Put this there. Okay. I should unlock it. Oh, you just want me to go down a dark tunnel? Do I even have a flashlight? Let's just run. Oh, I do. Thank God. All right. Just run, Ethan. We face it together, man. Oh, God. I just hear things rocking. Oh, God. What? This is the area that they were filming and being all creepy about. What is this? The ring now? Yo, know, there's so many genres. The freaking movie genres uh, or scary movies that I can just call out now that, you know, this could be a reference to. Oh, now I'm in a tunnel, and I have to grab this. Oh, you mean grab this, and I have to try to climb back up? Oh, shit, is something up there? The baby! Don't let them play with you, Ethan. Don't let them mess with you, Ethan. Just run. Just run, man. I'm so creeped out right now. I am so, like... Ah, this is the only thing about scary games is that sometimes they really oh shit where's this doll can I save I can still save that's amazing there's something around here it will be fine That's gonna be fine. This is a pool of blood. Oh my god, I didn't even see this. Alright, just freaking run it! Run at it! Run at it! Boy, freaking run at it! What the hell is this? What is this? 
Holy shit, what the fuck is this? What the fuck are you? Oh my god, that's the child! I'm not your dada. Oh shit, this shit's getting close. I am not your dada. Leave me alone. I am not your father. Your mama is not here either. Holy crap. What the hell is that? Alright. We're gonna escape this goddamn kid. This freaking monstrosity. I'm sorry, I don't mean to be rude. You know, all babies are beautiful, but this child is not. Work elevator. The power is still out. Hey. Where are you? Is he down? Is he coming back? Is he has he left the building? Has he left the building? Oh my god, I don't even want him to touch me because I can die. Hello? Oh god, he literally just went in here. Oh my god, he's been following me. How do I turn back on the power? Is there another door around here? Is there another door around here? Oh my god, I'm freaking afraid. Cause I don't even know if this child is still around. Oh, okay. Relief of a child. Okay. That means that this is for another door, I'm assuming. Child. Little creepy baby. You're not here, right? Oh, the dolls are here. I just do not like this whatsoever. What, man, am I freaking. Oh. Oh! And this doll's here. Screw you, man. Just step on it. Just step on it, Ethan. Kill it. Kill it. I need my freaking guns now. Oh my god, man. Tears may come to my eyes because of how afraid I am right now. What is this? Am I being told to get dressed into this outfit? Hide? Okay. I'm hiding. Wait, do I hide? Do I hide now? Do I hide now? Right. Turn on the light, Ethan, and hide under the bed. Because I have a belief that something is coming and it's not pretty. Ethan, you're breathing very loudly. I guess for the child to come, I need to attract it first. Yep. See what I mean? I think it's. Oh, what the hell? Oh, god damn it! Uh, go around, Ethan! Oh my god! Oh. No, 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 Oh. 
Don't be afraid of babies. Continue on. Oh my god. I'm not here. I'm not here. Come on. Keep on going. Keep on going. Peace, mother flower. That's right, you get mad. I wish there was a way I could close doors behind me. But that I knew I had time. God damn it, this freaking child knocked it all down. And I have to run. And try to get past it again, I bet you. I bet you they're gonna try to play me and throw this freaking baby at me again. They're like, oh, you didn't get enough with the baby? Here, I'm gonna smack you with it again. <laughs> I've been afraid. Alright, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh my god, bro. What am I supposed to do? Just let the child come in? Oh god. Screw you, kid. Screw you. Yes, yes, get in, please get in. I'm just freaking dancing. I'm dancing. I'm dancing. I'm dancing. Ah, ah. I just want to go home. I don't want to care no more. Oh my god. Do I have my guns? I don't have my guns still. <laughs> Lady, this is not funny. You literally are traumatizing me. Oh god. Oh, what the hell is all this? Huh. Don't leave. I can't let you. You're still alive. Find you? What? Uh, amongst the dolls, I have to find you? Oh god. Oh, is that? Nope, that's not you. Oh, found you! I got you! Oh. Let this thing bite you. Oh. Fucking monster! Yes! Let me just open this just in case. Alright, I'm supposed to just keep looking for her now. Alright. She's like the one doll that's laying down. Like, wow, you couldn't hide any better? No, I guess not. Ah. The blood of a doll. Oh my god, this music's creepy. She's in here somewhere. Aha! Yeah, that's right. Just don't even give her a chance. Just keep that one. No, she's not a creepy doll. Uh, her blood is everywhere. She went back upstairs, I think. I think. Unless I'm going. No, I don't think so. Where'd she go? Oh, 
she's she getting undressed? What the hell is this doll doing? What is this, Annabelle? Where are you? Aha. Uh -huh. Found you. Yeah. Hey, now if I keep Whoa. What the heck are you? Stupid idiot! What are you doing to my cute friends? Cute friends? Oh god. It's over. Wow, like that? What? No way. Mia, I'll make things right. What? Oh. Good. I need to get out of this Like, place. honestly, yes. I, I, I really do, honestly. I'm... I've been traumatized. Nice. So that's who was behind all this? All right. This person. I need to pick up the doll. Do you have anything that I will have of youth? No. Of worth? No. Okay, cool. Alright. Let us, uh... Let us go on. Go on our way now and pick up... That makes two. I've picked up another part of my daughter. Oh, okay. Cool. Oh, wait. Do I have my weapons back? Oh, thank God. Alright. That was cool though. I didn't have to use my like, you know, my ammo. That was actually an uh, enemy that you didn't have to use your like, you know, ammo for. Just more like your wits and like just understanding and everything. And also you had to make sure that you, you know, didn't shit your pants during that interaction with that child. I truly don't know how I feel about that yet. But I, I'll recover one day. Maybe. God. But yeah, so that was pretty cool though. I still have a lot of ammo. I mean, a decent amount. Take me down. And now I get to sell this freaking doll. Oh, now that since. Since you're dead. Maybe I could put the doll here. No? Oh, interesting. There's gotta be something here. That's the legs for us. Alright. There's definitely something around that I can pick up and I can put there. I feel it. Did I not see this the first time around? Or what? Oh, what the heck? What is this? Did I... Oh, what? Oh! Oh! Not on no space in my inventory. I'll make enough space. Don't you worry. I got magnum out ammo for what? When? Oh, I'm definitely gonna buy more. Oh, what the heck? Why does this always happen? Every time. Alright. Close this door, let's lock ourselves in here if we have to. Let's pick up some mines. And uh, let's switch. Alright. Oh, what the hell is this? Oh, God. Oh, damn. What the hell happened to ya? Oh. Um. 
Oh, shoot. Hello. Hello. I'm sorry that this happened to you. Wow, there's like way too many. Oh, no. Yes. Well, alright. So, thank you for the contributions to my coin purse. I appreciate that. I really need some extra coins. Oh, look at that. Even more. Isn't that nice? What the heck, Dot? Did not know that this was an area. Or did I not know that this was an area because I was like, basically. Holy cr What the hell is this? This dude just like, dead ass just like, came out of nowhere. Make sure my area is cleared. Back. I never actually checked up here, did I? Yeah. <coughs> More magnum ammo. And a photo of a strange bird. I'll take that. Anything else in here? <coughs> Oh, wait, can I use this? This doesn't work for this one. Damn. That sucks. Explosive rounds. Examine key. To where? Examine. <laughs> That's a bit tough to read. Uh, November 10th, Miss... Donna is now Mother Miranda's adopted daughter. In all my years, I've never seen and never been this overjoyed ever since childhood. She's always feared others due to the scar across her face. After her parents' death, she locked herself away and would only talk to Angie, the doll her, her father made for her. I am forever thankful to Mother Miranda's infinite compassion. Uh, November 27th, Mistress Donna seems happy. It might be my imagination, but I feel like her doll Angie's even more likely than before. She came to me in the garden today and used Angie to talk with me. We had a mighty fine conversation. Something about receiving a gift of power from mother. Uh, Mistress Donna gave me yellow flowers and told me to plant them in the garden. I planted them in front of Miss Kalinda's grave. I don't know if it was the scent of the flowers, but I felt lightheaded then like a dream i saw my departed wife i mentioned this to donna she seemed thrilled by it she told me to go to the house tomorrow and see her she said i could see my family once more i'm not sure what she meant by that but she's so kind and i think that's the last time we ever heard of this person lived here and i guess i will save here and well I'll end this part here i hope you all enjoyed this video Drop a like on this video if you guys did. Hit that subscribe button. Drop a comment if you guys want to say hi. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.